Good evening, MLB The Show fans and baseball fans alike. I have decided to do a general manager franchise challenge. I've had some friends of mine that knew that I've always been a fanatic of the Yankees ask me, oh, hey, what if you play a team that's not quite up to the level as the Yankees are? Let's say the Reds. Well, I decided to go ahead and give it a shot. I'm going to do a three-year challenge. So, I had to learn about the Reds. Well, we got Johnny Cueto, right? No, no, we don't. He's gone. Okay, well, Matt Latos, he's a good pitcher. I got him. No, I don't think we do. He's gone also. Okay, well, we got Marlon Bird. Mm, do we? Yeah, no, we don't. Okay, well, we got a Brett of Simon. I, I remember him. No, we traded him also. Oh, crap. Okay, so what players do I have to work with here? Of course, we got Chapman, who holds the record with the fastest uh, baseball ever thrown still at 106, I believe. Uh, we got Homer Bailey. Uh, he's a good pitcher. That's nice we got him. We got one of the fastest baseball players ever of Hamilton. Um, that's great. We got Votto right there in the picture with uh, with Hamilton, so that's that's good. Uh, we got Todd Frazier. That's awesome. Okay, I really like Todd Frazier. Great third baseman. Uh, let's see, Jay Bruce. I liked him. He was actually the, the face of the Reds for a while. I remember that. So what kind of players do we have to work with, uh, given the fact that we trade away a lot of our good talent? Well, as for pitchers go, like we mentioned before, Homer Bailey, he's going to be pretty much the man taking the lead. Uh, we have Anthony Descafani, whom we received with the trade from Miami for uh, Matt Latos. A very young and talented, talented pitcher. Your Gino Torres, who we got from the Tigers for Alfredo Simon. Uh, him and Jonathan Crawford, if I remember correctly. He's a uh, 23-year-old shortstop. We also got John Lamb, who is one of three left-handed uh, top prospects that we got from the Royals for Cueto. Uh, he's the prospect that I'm going to keep my eye on. He's going to start off at AAA, of course, and... Uh, going to bring him up as soon as he shows progress. Brandon Finnegan was also the left-handed uh, pitcher we received from the Royals and also Cody Reed. So all three of them we're going to keep an eye on and uh, if they show promise, we'll bring them up. So we got some good pitching prospects. Um, but someone else that we got from uh, Cuba was Rizel Iglesias. And uh, this man right here, he shows a lot of promise. So I am very looking forward to seeing how far he goes within this three-year span with this challenge. I have a feeling that this young pitcher here is going to be the ace of the operation by the time the three years are up. So I think that's the general idea of uh, some of the players' uh, prospects and such that I'm going to be paying attention to a lot to try to build this uh, Reds team into something uh, more than what they've shown. They have a lot of potential, this, this Reds team. They really do. So I would really like to let them be at least playoff contentions. World Series champion would be great, but given the fact that it's a three-year mark, going to be hard we got a lot of good ball players out there but i hope to do the best that i can and this is going to be fun i am against the grain and this is the general manager's reds franchise series challenge